Hey, MJ, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Combing through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten-hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. You could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cause. You know, it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. It's kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. This is Sable Control. What's the situation in Columbia? Calling agents in Manhattanville. Requesting an update on your status. Roger Control, this is APC. Someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Means and ends, Hulk. All of my means and ends. And for these particular means. Freedom! True freedom! No more feud! No more rhino! Without you, I make less trouble for you. So what about our stimulating battleside chats? You are funny, Maliki. I am almost sorry.
Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't... Beg him to give up? Yes, Garchin, that is exactly what I would have thought. Ah, like an old married couple, you two! on the ground. Gadget's my Stop. gadget. What are you doing? Lay in patty cake, you idiot! Help me! Get him! Calm down and help! Guys, please! There's plenty of me to go around! Getting his suit removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Gargan has no friends. He fights for profit. Untrue. I'd rip Spider-Man's face off for free. The money's the boat. Keep talking to him. I'll take care of you after I finish. 
finish the bark! Move it, Gargan! Like an 800 pound handbag! Now you know. I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! Come here, Ouch. I will teach you to throw real punch! My jaw's already absorbed that particular lesson. Thanks! I hear you took a poetry class on the raft? Like a therapy thing? Now, here is Blaze. Along came Spider. I sat down beside him. Then crushed his tiny body to bear. That's so good! Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crime. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up way a minute, Mr. Negative. That's gold, Jared. Gold. Trademark it. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. There's the security room, but 
that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet okay. you. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Control, I heard something. Running a sweet. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers work with elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable Ape. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. Did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Useless button. Hmm. <sighs> Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The fat Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's- MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Doors are locked till the system check finishes.
work order for a key padlock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. The city's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Uh, Hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick... Everything changed. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Norman and Otto. Wow, they look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. 
Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Control. Status. Nothing to report. Copy that control. We're five by five. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the- Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath. Are using it to stoke wow, Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michael's. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotics ex- No movement from- Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Commercial buildings. Wow. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti-serum in a shopping center. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. No, I need to track Michaels. Ben Adder is a dead end. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti serum is, he must have been too. Oscorp's going all in on defense. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Good ol' Alpha Team. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's nice. 
Got some overlap with Dr. Michael's path. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Status clear. Here. 
turning off Lex now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to fight Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This will all be over soon, I promise. these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers.
web down that tower. Need to get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti serum. guys off stealthily. Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. I'm tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! We got a man down! Inside. Wish 
Sable would cut me some slack. We should be on the same team. Down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen. I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Does this mean we're good? Will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh. Oh. friends. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. <laughs> okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. This is insanity. I have to find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. No way to go but down. No matter what's down there. Turn back, Spider-Man. This is me and Oswald. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne. Because of me! Because of what Osborne did to me! You're more than your past! Don't let it control you! I tried so hard to make my parents proud! To honor their legacy! But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice! I won't let you do this, Martin!
Lee's pain. His anger. It's fueling his power. sample. Martin, don't let revenge win. Fight it! <laughs> 